All right, what's up, people? Uh, out here in Arizona, and uh, for whatever reason, my starter is not engaging. I'm not sure why. Uh, it's not the battery, it's not the voltage or anything like that. I haven't checked the fuses or the relays yet, but that's what it could be. It also could be the ignition, the ignition, ah, ignition switch, or the clutch switch. Um, but I haven't tested any of those either. But this video is basically, you know, if you're in the time crunch, you really don't have the tools necessary to check everything. I have the tools, but like I said, I haven't checked it yet. Um, but if you don't have the tools to check everything and you're just trying to see if the actual starter works, this is how you jump the starter. So first, you're gonna turn the key, make sure it's on. All right. Once you do that, you're gonna make sure the shifter is in neutral. Make sure you are in neutral. Keys on. As you can see, I have good battery voltage. All right, so we're on the passenger side of the truck and the starter is right here. This is the solenoid and the whole, this whole assembly right over here is the starter. All these wires, you got a block of positive wires, you got a block of negative wires down here. But what you're gonna wanna do is, you wanna touch the positive, any positive on your truck, whether you start from right here, or me, I'm gonna start mine from right here cause it's just easy to put my finger right here. But you want one of the line from here to this wire right here. If you touch these, the starter ain't engaging, it'll crank up. If your starter's not bad, so that's what I'm gonna do right now. All right, so I got my wire. Like I said, I'm gonna go from right here cause it's just easier to uh, get to. And then I'm gonna take the other end of the wire and just touch that top wire up there. I'll just touch the top of the solenoid. Make sure you don't touch anything else. 